His first and only season in Norman. He will hand it off to Kennedy Brooks, who runs for a first down in the first play of the day for Oklahoma. For loss on the season. Three plays, three Kennedy Brooks runs, and he matches his total from the Kansas State game. Adam. First pass play. Hurts lets it go right before he's hit. In coverage. Lamb goes up and gets it. Touchdown, Oklahoma. Those are two deep safeties. You're throwing into triple coverage, but that shows the kind of confidence. Eight into coverage. They'll do so here on third and short. They're able to find a window to the H-back Jeremiah Hall for an Oklahoma first down. Deficient passer. Hands it off here to Brooks. Stiff arms a man. Goes up the sideline, close to another first down. Down and a bunch on the ground as well. Take advantage of the underneath coverage here. C.D. Lamb carving through the defense to make it first and goal. Takes it first and goal from the A. They bring him in motion. Hurts takes it straight up the middle for the touchdown. And the Sooners making it look easy early on tonight. On pressure. Purdy throws high and incomplete. Off of the hands of Jones and it's fourth down. Back to back three and outs to begin. Iowa State, they've got a wide open hall, swinging out of the backfield here for their first first down of the game to the 31. Team, we're talking about a 6'2", 300 pound D-line. Purdy looked comfortable this time and hit the crossing transfer to Michael Petway. There's Washington. First and ten, here's Hall. Hall spins his way close to a first down. He glides, a true freshman that makes it look pretty easy. Here's the fastest receiver Iowa State's got, and Tariq Milton who can show off that speed. Down the sideline, touchdown. Important quick response from Iowa State as Milton goes 40 yards to get Iowa State on the board. They're trying to put the pedal down after that haymaker better than they did in Manhattan. Hurts off, play action, almost gets picked. Instead, it's CeeDee Lamb. Yeah, it's been every one of them. It was Bickham on the early touchdown. It was Eisworth, and this time Lawrence White is in the right spot. 20-yard loss, net. And so third down, 16. Hurts throws, finds Lee Morris, who is close to the first down. He's got it. First down from the 44. Hurts looking to run, now drops back, and he'll throw. He's got a first down. Brooks makes a cut for a first down. Third down four. Hurts facing pressure. Lofting to the end zone. Jump ball and a touchdown. Trajan Bridges. Stretch. Guys that have worked really hard. This is just your one-on-one. -on -one. I'm going to talk about it on the other side. Empty set for him here. Bringing pressure with Mike Rose who couldn't get there in time. It's Lamb hitting the accelerator. Cutting it against the green. Hurtling into the clear. There goes CeeDee Lamb. He gets a block. He gets inside the five. the second half and you're right back in it there's not a lot of room for air though here's Brees Hall spinning his way free Brees Hall what a run first down crossing the 45 on first down from the 46 Lang off the right side Lang hits the clear and he's got a first down Ted and Dylan Saner comes into the backfield as an extra blocker for Purdy got tripped up by Turner Yell but a nice first down gain for Purdy. Exactly what the doctor ordered here. Three consecutive runs by Iowa State. Late flag here. Personal foul. Face mask. Defense number 10. Three. Hall's back in the game taking the fake. Against pressure. Wide open man. That's a touchdown. It's Dylan Saner. First career score. All three timeouts for the Sooners. Hurts to run, makes Mike Rose miss. Stays on his feet to the 40. This is third and five, and against a blitz, Hurts underneath, has Hall very close. Let's see where he stepped out. Up seven or eight. Here they're bringing a couple of extra men, forcing Hurts off his spot. He's still able to beat him. 
Braden Willis, only his sixth catch of the season. He's got Lamb to the top of the screen. He pumps one way, runs the other, gets around Orion Vance, and gets close to a first down with Will McDonald making the stop. Looking for a big score here. C.D. Lamb in motion, takes the fake, hurts, waits, powers his way in for another touchdown. His fifth total in the first half. Tossed it into the short side, Maurice Hall. A block in front from Charlie Kohler. Kept on going, and second down and two. Three consecutive Hall runs to open this second half, and he stays on his feet to the 40. Oh, his crew responding. Hall again has a seam off the right side. Inside the 25. Pat Fields finally runs him out. 19 more for Hall. He sees it. They get the snap off. Swing it outside to Hall, who stays on his feet through initial contact and gets a first down. Well, he goes on the sideline for two plays of rest. Inside the five, Hall into the backfield. They're running with his direction on the option play. Purdy keeps it untouched. Touchdown, Iowa State. The drive that they needed coming out of the break. Keep it on the ground this time with Brooks trying to get to the edge and use his speed. He's got a first down. Stepping inside a defender, taking it to the 30 on a gain of 27. Yeah, here they come on third and four. Hurts scrambling, needs the 40. He's going to get it. On third down lately, this is going to be a free play. Hurts trying to make it, make him pay, and he does with a first down to Lamb. And down 14. Brooks has room off the left side. Gets a couple of blocks from Lamb. Springing him free, touchdown, Brooks with an assist from C.D. Lamb. Deshante Jones, one of the most productive receivers in the Big 12, held without a catch in the first half. He On second and ten, they fake it up the middle and toss it to Chase Allen. The tight end is inside the 15 first down and a gain of 29. Purdy steps up, tucks it, runs inside the 10. Unsportsmanlike conduct, defense number 44. Half the distance to go, automatic first down. That is on Brendan Radley Hiles in a huge call. Call on Radley Hiles. They fake it and toss over the top for a touchdown with Chase Allen. So a couple tight ends with touchdown catches today. Tackle, R.J. Proctor comes into the game, plays left tackle. Hurts out of a tight pocket to the sideline. Lamb gets away from Datron Young, loses the ball. Who's got it? I, I think it was Peterson that comes in here as C.D. Lamb. Well, it's done what he's done all night, and that's make the first Cyclone miss. But look at the team pursuit. And Peterson there, I think, rips the ball away, forces the fumble. Purdy on a design quarterback run has a first down, but a flag down. And this is coming back. Sooners bringing pressure. Purdy trying to beat it. Flag down. Had a first down. Holding. Defense number 10. Purdy with all day. Over the middle. That's caught for a first down by Jones. Option play. Purdy. Dangerous throw. Hall's got it, but he's driven out close to the 20 by Radley Hiles. Purdy given time. He's in trouble to the end zone. Incomplete. And three touchdowns through the air. Works off play action on first down. He's on the roll. He lofts one for Milton, who is able to bring it in near the 40. Wow. I've... Four minutes left to go as Purdy retreats with his eyes downfield. Steps up in the pocket. He'll take off. He makes a man miss inside the 40. Bounds at the 33. Stands tall. Delivers to a wide open man. It's a touchdown. Hurts looking to throw on third and seven. He's retreating with Spears chasing him, and he throws an interception. Lawrence White picks it off. Hard. And ultimately, Hurts cuts down half the field with this scramble. Runs out of real estate, runs out of room. And those three of them in the first half, they went... 
Purdy scrambles. He'll tuck it, makes a move. He's going to get a first down. Brock Purdy making moves in the open field for 16. Snap it with a minute left. Purdy given time. Delivers sideline. He's got Kohler for his first catch of the day. Near side of the field. On third and more. Purdy lofting. End zone. Kohler! Touchdown! They've come all the way back. You knew it was going to be on the two-point conversion. A little early contact, but the only spot Purdy could put it. Been for one last gasp, if they can get it with an onside, that's hit hard to the wrong guy. C.D. Lamb's got it, and Oklahoma will move to 8-1, and one despite this incredible charge from Iowa State here in the fourth quarter. Wow.